Welcome to Headline News 24/7. Please click like and subscribe. Breaking: Trump just did it. They're scurrying like rats. In light of the ongoing problem of illegals jumping across our southern border, President Trump signed a proclamation Wednesday night to send National Guard troops in to fix the problem. For years, these illegal criminals have exploited loopholes in our laws, where traffickers advertise that if migrants have children with them, that they'll be able to make America their new home. But now in light of President Trump's plan to get our military involved, these idiots have suddenly had a change of heart and have abruptly abandoned their plans overnight. AFP reports that a caravan of migrants decided to not travel to the U.S. border, after hearing of how infuriated Trump was over finding out of their plans to infiltrate our country. AFP reports. A caravan of Central American migrants whose trek across Mexico infuriated President Donald Trump has decided not to travel to the U.S. border, leaders said Tuesday. We will wrap up our work in Mexico City, said Irenio Mujica, the head of the migrant advocacy group People Without Borders, Pueblo Sin Fronteras. We have support teams at the border if there are people who need assistance there, but they would have to travel on their own, he told AFP in the town of Matias Romero, in the southern Mexican state of Oaxaca. The Republican president vowed to send the U.S. military to secure the border and threatened to axe the North American Free Trade Agreement (NAFTA) if Mexico did not stop the caravan. This comes on the heels of Trump's announcement that he would be signing an executive order to send the National Guard to assist the Border Patrol. Homeland Security Secretary Christian Nielsen made the announcement on Wednesday. Over the past week, Border Patrol agents in the Laredo sector of Texas continued to find more Bangladesh nationals being smuggled across the border from Mexico. Agents arrested 12 over the Easter weekend alone. It goes to show that our agents are arresting people from all over the world on a daily basis. Their intentions for entering the country illegally can only be determined after they have been arrested, Laredo Sector Assistant Chief Patrol Agent Gabriel Acosta said in a written statement. Breitbart reported. Agents arrested eight Bangladeshis during a two-week period in March, Breitbart Texas reported. They crossed the border from Nuevo Laredo in two separate events on March 28 and 29, officials stated. One week earlier, agents from the sector arrested nine after they illegally crossed from Nuevo Laredo as well, Breitbart Texas reported. One week before that, agents in this same sector arrested seven more. The Los Cetas cartel controls human smuggling in the region. The arrest of these people from Bangladesh shows there is a clear pipeline through the Middle East to Mexico and onto the southern border of Texas. Border Patrol agent Hector Garza said in his capacity as president of the National Border Patrol Council Local 2455. We have been lucky to catch these groups but there is no telling how many other people from countries that sponsor terrorism could be utilizing that same pipeline. This part of the border lacks physical barriers that would help prevent these types of crossings, Garza stated. There is nothing to stop these types of crossings. It's so refreshing that we finally have a president in office who genuinely cares about the people he leads and whose main mission isn't to destroy our country like the Obama administration was. You can be sure there will be more cursing and gnashing of teeth coming from the left, and Trump's move will no doubt spawn more his bigot comments from liberals, who were frantic to fight Trump's crackdown on their previous illegals who provide a hefty cushion to their voter base. That was the news. We thought you might be interested in knowing about this. Please click like, and subscribe. Thank you.